We truly believe that science is a tool that can solve the world's biggest challenges. We want to give every student the opportunity to experiment so that they can be the change makers of tomorrow. At lab for You, our mission is to democratize science and change the way science is taught. I was born in Chile and I've always been very passionate about science. When I entered to study biochemistry, we did have lab equipment, but there was not always the right number of equipment. Not everyone would run the experiment, and that's in the university environment. 88% of the schools in Latin America don't have any lab equipment. When I saw that there were so many students that were curious but did not have the right tools to actually learn science, you need to live the experience of scientific experimentation. I mean, you cannot learn how to ride a bicycle reading a book. You need to live that experience, right? And it's the same in science. And that was something that we did not see inside the schools. That's when it really struck me and said, something must be done. For the first time in human history, we have a massive vehicle. We've got more than three billion smartphones around the world. I was finishing my master's in biochemistry, and at this event, Startup Weekend, I met Alvaro Jose Peralta, who's a software engineer. We decided to leverage the built-in sensors that already come in smartphones, you know, the accelerometer, the sonometer, the camera, and design experiments so that students and teachers around the world can experiment with the lab in their pockets. We started lab for you four years ago in Chile, and now we are in San Francisco, California. In a category, let's say movement, you choose an experiment and it's going to guide you step by step on how to run the experiment. Here you'll see open accelerometer, new measurement, press go. Here my hand's not moving, so there's no change in the graph. But here when I start moving, you'll see the change in the graph. Three, two, one. Good job. All children love to create, to experiment. One of the best things about lab for You is that without a whole lot of explanation, they're able to take that tool and start creating experiments. Today we did a skateboard experiment with lab for physics and pretty much what we did in that is we tested the iPad on different surfaces. Third graders, welcome to lab for physics Today you are going to be participating in some experiments that the eighth graders have designed. We're sliding down the iPad to see and measure the speed it goes down based on the distance and time. And we're teaching the little kids how to do that so that they can learn a little more too. If you go to a school and you see the students actually experimenting by themselves and they want to do it again and again, see that inspires us because yeah. now science yeah. is not just yeah. a bunch of formulas. It's actually students asking questions and experimenting and living science. I love doing those because it's more fun than worksheets. I prefer to work with things that are in my hands. I'm very honored and thankful to be named Toyota Mother of Invention. We are a small team of ordinary people trying to do extraordinary things. So it's really motivating and inspiring because it gives us the energy to continue fighting for our mission. We truly believe that if we can give every student the opportunity to have a lab in their pockets so that they can see the world around them and experiment, we can make a difference and we can have a better world.